Hello everybody, this is Skyrim's Gadgets, and I'm going to be showing you how to put wire mod in the specific folder that is correct. There's stuff I need to show you that people just don't know how to put it on, so I'll help them. And if you go on people's servers and you see this error Lua coding just streaming down the side of your window, that means they have the wrong updated version of wire mod. And here I'll be showing you how to get wire mod and all that. Okay, first off, you go to your web browser. Once that's done, you type in Google search Tortoise SVN and you will get this Tortoise SVN. Now you go on to it and this will be here. So, what you'll be needing to do is go to the download page, it's right here, latest version, download page. Okay. Go to whatever you have for your computer. It will probably say in right click computer properties, or my computer if you have Windows XP. Okay, 64-bit operating system, so that's what I have. That's what I need to download. Once you have that, you'll download it to wherever your play directory is for wherever you want to download it to. Uh, it'll take some time on depending on how fast your internet connection is. So I already have it downloaded and installed. You just have to install, 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 blah, 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 blah. I don't th think I have to show you how to install something. So once you have that installed, you make a new folder on your desktop, just for now, it'll be easier. Make a new folder and call it, call that new folder, wire. If I need to be more specific, you'll right click on your desktop, new, folder. It's, it goes on throughout XP, so just do that once you have that. And you already have SVN installed you go back to your web browser you type in wire mod wire svn wire svn right here first thing wire mod svn guide i'll just put the link in the description just to make it easier for guests so would you look in your description you'll find this link right here then you go back to your desktop your folder you right click it it says SVN check out you click that right here you are respiratory you paste it there okay and let it do its thing it's downloading it right now all the updated files and folders and once that's done, you will get this. Well, it'll be like that, but this is a different name of the folder. So this is what will be in the folder, this. Now, what you need to do is go to com Computer, C, Program Files. You look for your Steam. Go to Steam Apps. You go to your username, you go to Gary's Mod, Gary's Mod, Add-ons, and there you go. You have your add-ons. Okay, hold on. Okay. Once you have that there, here's the folder that's already been downloaded. You take your advanced duplicator, if you don't have it already, but we're not going to do that right now. Okay. You take your Lua wire, wire model pack. The SVN just tells you if you have it installed wrong. But you can have that in there if you want. I suggest it just to make sure if you have it incorrectly. So once you have that, you just pull it on into your add ons folder. Blah, 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 blah. 
add-ons. The add-ons. Yes. Yes. Okay. And once that's done, voila, you have it done being installed correctly. Please PM me over Skype, email, Scalver Scalver Tech at Scalver.com if you want to email me. Steamy is Scalver. Um Skype is Scalver Tech, all lowercase. Um just send me a message if you need help of anything else. So, bleh. thanks for watching. Oh yeah, and it's still downloading for here. So, don't worry about the spread explanation mark. It's still correct. It's just acting funky. But once you have Tortoise SVN installed, you have your link. You do the respiratory, you do your directory, and then voila, you have it. So, thanks for watching.